Hey everybody and welcome to DC That's Me. I be she, she be her, and her be me. So this is my very first mukbang, okay? And what kind of mukbang is this? This was always going to be a vegan mukbang, okay? As I am 100% plant-based, you know, no, no meat, no dairy, none of that. But it's cool though because we about to get into some very good food and what better way to show you my love for plant-based eating by showing you my favorite thing to eat which is tacos because it is taco Tuesday. So I'm going to stop talking because I know y'all ain't come here to just see me talk right y'all want to see me eat. So just to show y'all what we got here. What we got here, what we got here. So I have two different types of plant-based meats. This one is TVP right here, this crumbly one, TVP. And then this one right here, this is soy curls. So yes, um, this one is soy-based. Uh, both of these are soy-based, but you can make them different ways. You do like cauliflower, you can do lentils, you can do a whole bunch of stuff. But for the sake of time, I did this one, okay? And so I got some homemade guacamole, mole, 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 mole. I got some lettuce. And then I bought some sour cream. I could have made some, but I was just being lazy. So my favorite one, my favorite store bought one is Tofuti. I'm telling you, like seriously, you can tell the difference. And then I made some, uh, you can't see it right here, but I made some rice. And I'll uh, talk about that later, how I made that, okay? So let's get started, okay? Y'all ready? Okay, here we go. So which one am I going to start off with? I think I'm going to do... I'm going to do TV poo. Let me get this one. I'm going to do TV poo. And you see, I have no cheese. I have no cheese. I didn't feel like doing the cheese thing. I mean, like I could do like the pasta cheese, but I mean, honestly, to be, on to be completely honest, I like to do my tacos without it. I like to just have just a little bit of me, you know, and when I was, before I went vegan, I will admit, before I went vegan, um, before I went plant-based, I, um, I honestly used to douse my tacos in cheese and sour cream and a whole lot of meat and stuff like that, and then when I started discovering different ways to make your tacos, I swear I've been, like, hooked on the way this is. Like, so seriously, I'm going to put some lettuce and everything on there. And we're about to get into some eating, y'all. All right, y'all? Y'all ready? I think I'm going to do a thumbnail real quick. Like. Okay. So, um, God is good. God is great. Let us thank him for our food. Amen. All right. So, now we can eat. All right. Mm. 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 Y'all going to see this a whole lot, my big mug. And what I got in here, um, this is, this is cranberry pomegranate juice. So, it's so good. If you ain't up on that, get you some, okay? Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. And normally, sometimes I have like some hot sauce or something like that. But I season this so good. So good. Mmm. Mmm. No more soup. Alright, we're gonna do the, um,. You know, I can these soy curls. And for those who want to know, okay, what is TVP? What is soy curls? Okay, TVP stands for texturized vegetable protein. It stands for texturized vegetable protein. Basically, it's like a dehydrated soy. And what you can do is like you can soak it in water or like a vegetable broth or... um. 
or whatever flavoring you want. And you can cook it down and you can use it for different things like how I did with tacos. Um, I also like to do uh, spaghetti with mine too. Um, what else? I like to make like vegan sausages and all sorts of wonderful things. Ooh, shepherd's pie, seriously. For those who love shepherd's pie and you're trying to find a good way to make it without the meat, I'm telling you, just stay tuned. Stay tuned. Seriously, the videos to come, y'all will see all these wonderful, great things. Some of them will be homemade by yours truly, and then some of them will be store-bought. But I want y'all to be able to see plant-based eating. So here we go. Mm. 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 Oh, my God. That flavor was so wet. Did some sauce on. Mm. 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 The way I get these, I mean, it's good. Oh my goodness. Mm. So the soy curls, I soaked them in water because, um, like I said, they dehydrated too. That that's basically like a soy soup, just a different version. So what I did was I soaked them in water for about ten minutes, and then I cooked them with a little oil. And what else? I put like some cumin, some chili powder, garlic powder, onion powder. I put a little bit of salsa and a whole bunch of stuff. I'm trying to remember exactly what I did. Now I cooked it down I think for like five, ten minutes. Mm. Oh my god. And there's rice. Okay. This rice, I um use some basmati rice. Oh man, that was good. I use some basmati rice, and what I did was I cooked that down with a little bit of oil, and I took some saison. What y'all know about that saison? I put some. I took some saison, and I um cooked it with that for about like a five five minutes. Until it starts to get a little brown. And then all I did was add some water. Some water. And then I added. What else did I add? I added uh, some salsa. I love my salsa. I put. um, But this particular salsa. I think I used some habanero salsa. And just so you know. Like all of my food. I purchased mostly. From Whole Foods. And from. Oh, excuse me. Um, and from um Aldi. Like seriously, do not sleep on Aldi. If you have an Aldi near you, you have an Aldi near you. I'm telling you, go and like hit it up. I'm t man. When you start discovering like, oh wow, well, I don't have to because it's it's a whole misconception that vegan food is extremely expensive. No, it is as expensive as you make it. Okay. It really, really is. And, like, Aldi has been a big, big help. Like, sometimes I can spend, like, $20 or less a week and, like, will eat. I mean, like, I ain't talking about, like, little portions. I can eat, eat. Seriously. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I'm telling y'all. The way I did this TVP, though... Mm. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. 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 Mm.
Like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is all bad. And I'm not lying, y'all. I'm not just saying this for this video. Like, seriously. Plant-based eating is like... It is what you make it. I hear all the time people like, mm -mm, I don't like the vegan food. It tastes nasty. It's bland and all that. Let me tell you something, okay? Do not sleep on the plant-based food, okay? I hear all the time people talk about their um they co-workers brought food and everything and it was horrible. No offense to your co-worker. I'm pretty sure they may be a nice person. But their food probably wasn't good because they don't know how to cook. I'm just saying. You got to season that food. You got to put the herbs and the spices and all of that good. Like, for real, you got to get up in there and put all of that stuff in there. And I'm telling you, it will respond well. And it will come out like this. It's amazing. Mm, mm, mm. You know, I got food all over the place. I got more food on the plate. Yeah, now I put it in my mouth, huh? It's just dripping everywhere. I don't know. Maybe I need to get some nails. I be seeing a lot of the um, a lot of the um, <laughs> mukbangers. They be having their nails and things like it. Just be collecting everything. I don't know. So like I said, this is my first. But man, I just wanted, I always wanted to do this, but I was a little bit nervous because I keep myself together. <laughs> People who know me, they know I keep myself together. So to put myself out there like that and show y'all how I really get down when I'm at home, it's different. But nevertheless, I wanted y'all to be able to see what plant base. Hold on. I wanted y'all to see what plant-based eating looks like. You know? It's good. It's good. <laughs> but, uh, like, seriously. Um, I don't know what my next, um, my main video is gonna be, but we gonna see. We gonna work it out. Yes, we will. So, um, I've been vegan, just so y'all know. I've been vegan two years. <laughs> well, I, um, I know I keep going back and forth for vegan and plant-based. I'll explain it in the next video. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. And that's another thing, too. You will get a little bit gassy. But it's okay. It's good gas. Everybody needs to release it. But anywho, I've been vegan, I've been vegan, plant-based for two years and counting. I started out as a pescatarian. And I did that for like, I'm sorry, I did that for like seven months, okay? And in between that, I was learning how to make all sorts of different things. Thanks to YouTube, you know, so many different uh, vloggers and bloggers, you know, showing how to be able to do things. I'm like, okay, I can do that. And then my creative juices start flowing. And then I started making my own stuff. Like this. And to be honest, like, tacos is actually, like, one of the first things I veganized because it is my favorite food. Ask anybody that knows me, I can eat tacos every day and not get bored. Because it's, like, an unlimited amount of different tacos you can eat. Like, seriously, who doesn't like tacos? Like, seriously, if you don't like tacos, you're probably not my friend. I'm just saying. No offense. But, yeah, your life sucks a little bit. Just a little bit. Not a lot, but a little bit. 
We don't know what you're missing, like taco, hard shell, soft shell, lettuce wrap, spinach wrap, whatever. Anything with something wrapped in it. So good. I don't care. Mm. It is so good. Oh my goodness. Like, how many was that? Four? I'm gonna eat one more because I'm starting to fill it. I am starting to fill it. I'm serious. This mug. Oh, by the way, this mug. Big mug. That's what I call it. Big mug. Dollar Tree. Seriously. So, if you had a Dollar Tree near you, don't sleep on them. I know some people are like, oh, you get what you pay for. But sometimes you can find some really good quality for not a lot of quantity. Okay? All right? So, yeah, I'm going to eat one more. Whew. Oh, I am starting to feel it, y'all. <coughs> I am starting to feel it, y'all. You know, that fullness, it starts to hit you. At the stu at your stomach, the bottom at your stomach. Ooh, I'm really feeling this, y'all. Like when I first did this lifestyle, at first I was eating a whole, 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 whole lot. It's because your body is trying to, you know, get used to, you know, not eating so much because meat really takes up a lot of space in your stomach. So I was eating a lot to fill it up, but as I continued with the lifestyle, my stomach started to shrink. So I def definitely don't eat as much as I used to. Now, every once in a while, I get them big splurges where it's like, man, I'm just eating all day. You know what I'm talking about. But yeah, this is going to be the last one though. But. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am a happy eater. You know how it is. When something real good, you start humming, you start moving. Ain't no music playing, but in your head. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm sorry, let me get a napkin because this is getting too messy. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. But, y'all, seriously, tacos, I can't get enough of them. Can't get enough of them. I just can't get enough. Can't get enough of your love, babe. I'm all off key, but well, I don't care. Mm -hmm. This type of food, seriously. If you want to transition or show somebody how good vegan food, plant-based eating is, stock them off with tacos. I'm telling you. You'll thank me later. Start them off with tacos. You'll be like, ooh, there's some good stuff right here. As a matter of fact, there's a bunch of people who have turned on to plant-based eating because of tacos. I'm telling you, tacos have saved a lot of people. I'm just saying, is that good? Don't let nobody trick you to thinking that in order for you to enjoy yourself a good old taco, 
Daddy got to have a bunch of meat. If you want to eat meat, that's up to you and your people. But right here, this is all vegan. And it's all good. And I am all full. <laughs> all full. Not some the way full, but I'm all the way full. This was awesome. You hear me? All and some. Okay? All and some. But, um, hmm. Mm. I really thank y'all God is good That was real good Cranberry pomegranate I'm telling you You'll get your life ten times over I'm telling you But anywho I truly thank y'all for tuning in. Y'all keep watching. Y'all stay tuned. The videos will get better. This is my first time going, so I don't know what mistakes I done made. <laughs> but nevertheless, you know, you got to start somewhere, right? So thank y'all for tuning in. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel. Comment, like, and do all of that. Peace and blessings, y'all. Bye.